Chicago with his pal Spinner and Paddlefoot in another exciting adventure, The Jungle Train. Hey, Clutch, look! A pigeon on our windowsill. Something's tied to his leg. Carrier pigeon. What's it say, Clutch? Where's it from? Our old friend Chub Perkins. He's in trouble. I gave that pigeon to Chub Perkins so he could send us a message if he ever needed us. Wouldn't send for us unless it was really important. Golly, do you think wild animals are after us? Ah! I doubt it. I'm sure he has the weapons to fight off wild animals. No, I think it's something else. Maybe much worse. Anyway, I sent the pigeon back with another message telling Chub we'd be there. The pigeon should be arriving at Chub's about now. Clutch is right. The pigeon is arriving, but it doesn't go to Chub Perkins. Someone else has seen it and is calling it. Here, Pidgey. Here, Pidgey. Nice, Pidgey. Come and get some corn. Gee, Whiplash, that's clever of you. Yeah, I thought that was clever, making friends with Chubb's Pigeon. Now, let's see what the message says. I wonder who Chubb Pikin sent the Pidgey to. We'll know in a minute. Well, well, well. What is it, boss? It's from Clutch Cargo. What do you know? I've been waiting a long time to get even with him. And at last, I got my chance. <laughs> That's pretty good. You'll get even with Cargo and take over Chubb's plantation all at the same time. <laughs> right. And now we go to work. You got something nasty for me to do, Whiplash? Everything you do is nasty. Grab shovels and a pick and follow me. Jungle territory right now, Spinner. Ah! Yeah, sure looks wild down there. Wild, untamed jungle, Spinner. And that river looks like it's filled with man-eating crocodiles. We haven't much farther to go, Spinner. That river flows right in front of Chubb's place. That's how he ships his bananas. Without that river and a boat, he'd be lost. You mean that's the only way he could travel? Right. Only other way is by air. Meanwhile, a few miles ahead at Chubb's landing strip. What are we digging this animal trap way out here for, boss? To catch a big bird in, Victor. Clutch cargo's clean when he comes in for a landing. Now, we'll cover the hole with branches and straw and spread the dirt around. Looks just like part of the runway. Clutch cargo will never know the difference. <laughs> Oh, I hear a motor. I bet that's them. <laughs> it is. They're coming. We're going. Come on. Looks like Chubb has kept the strip in pretty good condition. Here they come, boss. <laughs> I wish I could see their faces when they hit that big white hole. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure your safety belts are tight. Okay, Clutch. I'm holding paddle foot. Dead silence. Will Clutch and company survive? Be sure to tune in for the next exciting episode with Clutch Cargo. received a message by Carrier Pigeon from Chubb Perkins. They left immediately for Chubb's plantation. Unfortunately, Whiplash and his henchman, Victor, are determined to stop Clutch from reaching Chubb. <laughs> That'll take care of Clutch Cargo and his pals. I hope they're not banged up too much. Yeah, boss, I'm sorry I didn't get to meet him personally. <laughs> Come on, let's scare Chubb Perkins a little. Silence prevails at the wrecked plane. <sighs> Spinner. Spinner, are you okay? I, I think so, Clutch. Golly, what happened? Some kind of trap, Spinner. It'll take a month to repair the plane. 
Come on, Spinner. Let's head for Chubbs. He may be in worse danger than we thought. I'd like to get my hands on the one who did it. The one who did what? Well, uh, Swampy. Hutch boy and Spinner and Paddlefit. Who's this you'd like to get your hands on? The person who tried to do away with us by digging that big hole in the landing strip. Is that what that big crash was? I was just on my way to see Chubb when I heard it. So I climbed this tree to get a better look. Couldn't see a thing. Vines and trees too thick. We're real glad to be talking with you right now. Yes. Let's get along to see Chubb. He's got troubles too. So you see, Perkins, your friend Clutch Cargo can't help you now. Too bad. All you had to do was sign this banana plantation over to me, and none of this would have happened. Yeah, he's the cause of it. He made us do it, right, Whiplash? Yeah, and seeing as how I got the only boat on the river now, and you have no other way to get your bananas out of here, you'll lose your banana crop and the plantation, too. Think it over, Perkins. Do you give me the plantation, or do you want more trouble? Please, Whiplash, just let me think. Okay, we're leaving, but we'll be back. As Whiplash and Victor leave, they start along the same path that is being used by Clutch and Company and Swampy. Hold it. I heard something. Get in the bushes. Whoever dug that hole probably thinks he got rid of us. We'll find him. You'll see. Come on, Victor. It's time for another nasty. The coconut palm. Chubb. Chubb Perkins. Clutch, my old friend. You're all right. Whiplash, sir. Whiplash? Is he back from prison? Back from prison and still trying to get my plantation. Whiplash and Victor have rigged up a palm tree slingshot and are about to shoot their coconut bomb. She's pointed right at him. And when this thing goes off, it'll blow him sky high. Can I lose it now, boss? Let her go. Wow. Will Clutch and his friends be blown to bits? Be sure to tune in for the next exciting episode with Clutch Cargo. and company after a crash landing caused by Whiplash and Victor met Swampy, an old friend, and Chubb Perkins. They had just arrived at the plantation when... Oh, oh. What's the matter, Paddlefoot? It, it's some kind of a bomb. Paddlefoot thinks it's a ball. He's gonna play with it. Paddlefoot, get away from that. Look at Clutch. He picked up the bomb. Hey! I'm in orbit. Orbit my foot, you idiot. He threw the bomb back at us. Let's get out of here. Fastest thinking I ever saw, Clutch. Thanks for saving us. Thanks to Paddlefoot for seeing it. No doubt about who did it. It was Whiplash. From now on, keep your eyes open. No telling what you'll think up next. Things happen so fast, Clutch, I forgot to welcome you. I'm so glad you're safe. And I'm so glad to see you, Swampy, old friend. What brings you here? I heard by Jungle Wireless that you needed help. What's your trouble? I'll show you. Wow, look at all those bananas. Whoa, look at them. My first love. I eat them boiled, oiled, nearly spoiled, mashed, hashed, broken, or bashed. Mm. If I don't get them shipped out of here, I'll lose everything. There'd be enough there to feed a tribe of hungry savages. By golly. That's how we'll get those bananas to market. What do you mean, Clutch? Our friends, the friendly headhunters. There are enough of them with canoes to ship all these bananas. Slippery banana peels, you're right, Clutch Boy. The chief is our friend. He'll help us. But how will we let him know? 
You leave that to me and that old oil drum over there. Get me a couple of heavy sticks. I'll show you. Clutch, do you think? I'm sure it'll work. And Swampy's ready with his jungle clubs. Just let me get my bums and my titties straight, and I'll send a message. All ready? Many miles away in the dense jungle, keen native ears listen to the drum beats made by Swampy. Why, it's my old friend Swampy sending us a message. There, I told them our story, and by golly, they're going to come. And I told them to hurry. Don't know what we'd do without you, Swampy. Shucks, take nothing. I'd like to get back to the plane and see how badly it's damaged. Don't forget to keep your eyes open for whiplash. No telling what he might do. Hold up. You hear something? Golly. It sounds like an avalanche. Could be an earthquake. Still? Whatever it is, it's big. Out of the way, everybody. It's coming right at us. What other nasty trick is Whiplash up to? Be sure to tune in for the next exciting episode with Clutch Cargo. Cargo with his pal Spinner and Paddlefoot in another exciting adventure, The Jungle Train. You remember last time, Chub Perkins was about to lose his plantation because he had no way to ship his banana crop. Suddenly, Clutch thought of the friendly headhunters. Swampy sent them a message while waiting for them to arrive. Hold up! You hear something? Golly! It sounds like an avalanche! Out of the way, everybody! It's coming right at us! Clutch! I'm scared! Hold your ground, man. Well, I'll be. It's our friends, the headhunters. I hope it didn't take us too long. I'd clean forgotten about that old trolley. A real estate fella named Smith put that thing in years ago. He planned to put in a housing tract all the way out to here. But something must have happened. Oh, yeah, I remember. I thought that streetcar trolley stopped running years ago. We were using it as a diner, don't you know? But when we received your call of distress, we decided to put it back into service. The only problem is, the battery is terribly low. I've got a big battery in the plane. We'll use it. Oh, wonderful. Now we'll be able to get my bananas to market. <laughs> Think they'll save Perkins' neck with that old trolley, eh? <laughs> We've got a few more nasty tricks for him, eh, boys? You said it. Now, while they're loading that trolley, I'm going to... That battery works well. Now all we have to do is load the bananas and get started. Can we all go clutch? If there's room. Shucks, there'll be room. I saw some extra wheels there at the barn. We'll make a trailer, then we can all go. Oh, boy! All right, boys, start loading. Guam key for dinner. Yum, yum, guam key tonight. Yum, yum, guam key You and Spinner help me build a trailer. The wheels are over there. I'll be with you, Clutch, soon as you get a few bananas. Yum, yum, guam key tonight. Yum, yum, rock tonight. Yum, yum, rock. Best bananas ever eat. Oh, boy, I'll say. While everybody is busy, on the other side of the trolley, Whiplash and Victor are also busy. Just cut that brake cable, Victor. Back to the boat. Now we'll get ahead of them and watch the fun. All finished. Okay, man. Let's get started. Very ingenious, Clutch. Yum, yum, guam tonight. Yum, yum, All aboard. That's a long uphill pull. Hope the 
battery holds hot. Once we get to the top, it's downhill all the way. Everything okay? Okay, Clutch. Thank you. 